guys welcome to the channel i hope you are doing well this is going to be a collective message you are my last reading of the day it is late here so i am getting this done now i'm going to try and do some readings in the morning i'm going to try to be an early bird messages for the collective at this time thank you to everybody who has liked shared and subscribed to the channel and my videos it is greatly appreciated i hope you are feeling blessed loved highly favored and protected at this time because you just are come on collective i don't need to tell you messages for the collective please what did the collective need to know at this time it could resonate for any sign do not force any message to fit please remember roles could be reversed gender roles are fluid mirror treat the body like the palace it is oh okay got five cards here we have let's see the protests start a revolution expectations don't seek anyone's approval some of you could be battling between um standing up for something or being assertive and just leaving it alone that's what i'm getting there's no middle ground whoever i'm speaking to it's almost like you you're either I, i'm speaking to somebody whose character is either all or nothing like you're either going to be assertive and really really driven to make something happen or you just don't care is what i'm getting some of you could be battling with a decision as to whether to say something here in a situation slay them all yeah whether to step up whether to um come with that fire i'm hearing tower unplug and relax for a spell take control of your own narrative Treat your body like the palace it is. Some of you are in a very um, independent energy. Some of you could be spending a lot of time relaxing here, taking a break. Some of you could have taken some sort of leave from work or you're having some downtime. I feel like you could have scheduled some sort of downtime that could be coming up or you're in at this time or you're being called to do so. Take it as it resonates, okay? Could be needing a break. You could have had some sort of chaos that's been going on. You could have been sort of on the go for a long time and there's some sort of reason as to why you may need some downtime here for some of you you could have been arguing or fighting with somebody or fighting about something okay with an individual and you finally just stepped into your, your own energy and you don't even care anymore for some of you you're definitely treating yourself you could be in this energy of self-care with the take control of your own narrative there's an energy of you taking the ball by the horns do you see how in this card you know we've got the hands that are controlling her and then in the next card that's right there that how i've drawn it here it's um how i've drawn the cards it's almost like she's set free from something you could be feeling very free in your energy at this time collective nine of pentacles independent self-sufficient energy free the nine of pentacles is an independent person it is a single person nine of pentacles is a very successful stable person in their own right okay masculine feminine use your discernment could be talking to evil one some of you could be a scorpio here some of you could be a fire sign here some of you could be a pisces crone of wands You're definitely feeling yourself at this time. That is the King of Wands energy. Some of you could be starting up a new business at this time. Some of you could have had some sort of award. That's really random. Some of you could have received some sort of award or recognition for something to do with your work more recently here. Something that you're really proud of the full card you're definitely in a very carefree energy you know i said it's like you don't care <laughs> bless me 
Three of Swords. Something that used to get on your nerves, something that used to bother you, something that possibly caused you pain. It's almost like you've taken control of your pain. Emperor card is here. Yeah, Ace of Swords. You're, ha you're having some sort of breakthrough over heartbreak or something that bothered you in the past, something that wasn't in your favour here. With the four cards, you've got a brand new beginning, Five of Swords. You could have dealt with a lot of mind games in the past. There could have been tit for tat. Somebody could have been playing games with you and you've put it to an absolute end. Death card, Scorpio energy, nine of cups. Yeah. I'm getting good selfish. Change of perspective, shift. Somebody could have left you in limbo here. You could be removing yourself, cutting away, I'm hearing. From this state of limbo here and really stepping into this energy of being very with the nine of cups some of you could be um definitely um in a more self self energy like a self-preserved type of energy here and i feel like that's after a period of time of not being in that energy is what i'm getting with that protest card you could have tried to stand up for yourself in a situation and you just realise that, you know what, those people's opinions is what I'm, it, this is what I'm hearing, you know, when you can't pay your bills with somebody else's opinion or somebody else's actions, it doesn't pay the bills. You know that saying? Eight of wands, forward movement. Okay. Crone of swords. You're definitely coming across very cold. You're in a very intense energy at this time. Some of you could be feeling detached or coming across detached people could view you as somebody who's in a very um stoic type of energy could people could be struggling to connect with you emotionally at this time here because you're very very logical some of you could be concentrating heavily on your work i'm getting a strong work ethic is what i'm hearing crone of cups there's a lot of crone energy here you're definitely in a very masculine energy, even if you're in a feminine, you're a feminine. We've got kings that are coming out everywhere. High priestess. Pisces. You could be a water sign. There's a lot of king. There's three kings here. Some of you could be in a same sex relationship, but it doesn't have to be. Some of you could like the same sex, but again, that does it doesn't have to be there's free there's really strong masculine energy here that you're sitting in at this time so some of you could need to balance out your um masculine feminine energies you know you could be really sitting in this masculine energy and you're needing to connect with your feminine feminine energy even if you are a masculine i must explain that even masculines need feminine energy in order to balance out okay feminine and masculine energies kind of go hand in hand when you're talking about energy and being in a good vibration here to function when something is off balance then that manifests itself in your character in your behavior and how you come across so having a balance is good the moon card some of you could be fearful of opening up to love again. Four of Swords, yeah. You could be in a very withdrawn energy for some of you here. Seven of Wands, you could be very guarded at this time. Justice card, some of you could be Librans or you've got Libra in your chart. Two of Cups, yeah, this is about relationships. A lot of you could be in an energy of not really wanting a relationship at this time. Yeah, Three of Swords. This is due to some sort of heartbreak that you've had to walk away from here. For some of you, this could have involved children with the Page of Cups. But there's an energy here of you walking away from heartbreak. Walking away from something where um, it was unfair to you in a situation here. But for some of you, I feel like you've gained some sort of notoriety in a workplace that that could be your justice. There's some sort of success that you could be seeing or feeling at this time you could have been um, awarded something recognized had some sort of increase some of you you've acquired a business of some kind here there's something that you've acquired that is your justice and the way that you are moving forward is in a very powerful kind of managerial energy very emperor-like masculine energy is what i'm feeling even if you are a feminine energy or a female however you um whatever you identify as 
some of you could have fears where it comes to a relationship i think i said that you could have dealt with a situation where somebody was playing mind games with you and you had to outsmart somebody or you had to kind of overcome that situation here king of cups energy in order to balance your um your energy chariot card yeah moving forward seven of cups opening up your options in what to give to some of you could be a bit confused with the two of swords there over where to invest or what to give to this could be stability wise some of you could be wondering where to invest some sort of shares or money because there's a strong energy here i'm getting entrepreneurial energy with the six of wands you've you've gained some sort of success here queen of wands confidence really passionate entrepreneurial energy somebody who's charismatic somebody who carries themselves in a way like they're going to dress for success is what i'm hearing somebody who carries themselves with the ability to know that you're going to win you know that energy if you put your suit on because you walk the walk type of energy that's what i'm feeling but there's an energy here of you needing to balance out that that feminine energy shrimp card yeah you could be two of coins yeah you could be um going back and forth on this a decision here queen of swords you're very cold some of you could be coming off very detached and cold this could be towards a specific person we've got the lovers card here could be a gemini that you're shutting out or you've withdrawn from somebody could have juggled you here there could have been options in love here king of swords that king of swords is back again so you've had to lay down the law with somebody or set a boundary somebody definitely could have been juggling holding on to another connection here while dealing with you collective could be a gemini libra and aquarius you possibly found out a truth about something here ten of coins this could have been a family situation where you had some sort of roots with an individual here yeah and you had to move away from this person some of you could have had to have distanced yourself nine of coins is showing itself again independent energy you've become single and i feel like whoever i'm speaking to you're not really interested in love at this time you could have been in a situation again like i said that has caused a great deal of pain could have been a betrayal involved somebody choosing somebody else over you and with the seven of wands that crone of swords you're in a very masculine detached energy so just be careful that you're you know if you want to be open to love there could be some healing that you need to be doing um, that i'm seeing in the energy but work wise and opportunity wise and your go-getter energy the dress to impress energy the charisma charismatic energy the um you know kind of like wanting to win energy got an eye for success got a drive to succeed is all here and i feel like that's probably where you're channeling your heartbreak into just being a go-getter into creating something good for yourself and there's something that you've let go of that was a bit chaotic in your energy you're definitely in a more self-preserved energy some of you could be spending a lot of time by yourself some of you could be a bit withdrawn from the outside world or you've withdrawn from somebody here somebody who could have been playing with your head somebody who could have been not not in the best energy self-sabotage type of energy here this could have been a person who was mean to you. This could have been a bully type of energy. Somebody could have bullied you. Somebody could have bullied you in a workplace, but I'm also getting this could have been an overpowering relationship where somebody tried to control you. Somebody tried to control something that was going on in a relationship here. You could have been dealing with somebody who was a bit mean spirited and you had to guard yourself from this person. With the moon card, there could have been a lot of things that this person was doing and saying behind your back that you was not aware of, okay? That could have come to the surface with the Ace of Swords. I did see the High Priestess in the shuffle, so this could have awakened you to kind of go on another journey here, is what I'm seeing. Let me pull you some prism, prism oracles. I said prism. Somebody could have been, could be going inside. I hope that's not you, collective. balance okay oh my eyes stinging yeah, i'm about to cleanse my energy and 
rest for the day because it's been a long full-on day cleanse yeah there's definitely something that you've cleansed out of your energy something that you could have been holding on to with the strength card here you're releasing something i feel like spirit has put a stop to something here spirit could have protected you rejection is protection is what i'm getting and cleanse something out of your energy you might not have known that this was divine intervention but i get a strong energy here of it being divine in intervention happiness here and you're going to be in an energy of being very um, satisfied, even if that is by yourself. Some of you, it is new love. Some of you, you're going to choose to open up to love again. If you've lost passion, that's going to be restored. The energy is here and abundance. This is literally the energy that I've been talking about. Success is at the bottom of the deck with flow. Abundance and energy. This is the energy, the energy for success, your drive, your hunger to succeed. This is what I see. This is what the reading was about. There's an energy here. So I'm not getting a strong love energy. I'm not getting a strong desire for you to really even be in a, in a commitment. Whoever I'm speaking to, collective, you've had some sort of pain, some sort of um, healing that you've had to cycle through. And I feel like you've gained some sort of success. And you're definitely sitting in the energy of abundance here. Some of you could not be ready to love. Some of you could not be in, might not be interested in loving at this time or being in a relationship here. But whatever this is that you're doing, you're having a breakthrough and you're coming out really, really strong doing it. Nine of coins energy. There's a lot of abundance here to be had. And I feel like you're gaining this. You could be a Libra. We've got Pisces. We've got Cancer here. We've got all the signs. Gemini, Libra and Aquarius, fire sign. Leo. Wow. That is what I have for you, Collective. If you like how I read, please like, share and subscribe to the channel. But until next time, I will see you soon. You take care. Mm -hmm. Take care. Bye.